Toto, I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our Stupid Rexy. It's I'm Corbin. I'm Rick. And we're in a car. Yeah, and it's raining. Uh, <laughs> so if this is weird for you, the uh, the tightness of the shot, the, the lighting, uh, sorry. Uh, we, we just went to our first Indian film since the pandemic happened in a theater uh, experience. Yep. Uh, Pushpa, the Telugu film starring Alu Arjun and a uh, sprinkling of uh, Fafa. A pinch, uh, just, a just, pinch just, of just, Fafa. Just a pinch of Fafa. Yeah. Um, but uh, so the reason it's right here is because this theater is not really close to Rick or I house. Right. And so we wanted to get, and it's also late. And so I wanted to get to you as fast as possible. And so we wanted to do it here so I can just go home and edit and upload. And uh, that would be it. So that's, that's why this is it. If it's, this is weird for you, I'm terribly sorry. This is just, we wanted to get to, to you as fast as possible. But uh, since it's new, we're going to do uh, m mostly non-spoilers. Mostly non-spoilers. Uh, mostly non-spoilers, just uh, in case y you are going to go watch it and whatever. And then maybe we'll get into some non-spoilers at the end. But uh, it's... Um, I, I don't know. I, I don't actually have the IMDb in front of me, so I can't actually. Uh, the director right give is, directorial um, and cinematography and all that is uh, the. I think his name starts with an S. I do apologize. And and is the story creator and and screenwriter yes. as well. Um, but we were very very excited uh, to see this uh, from the trailers. And uh, I could tell you probably safely that we were both probably pretty disappointed. Rick, you feel like that? Yeah. What what makes you say that, Corbin? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, without I don't want to give too much away. Although there are some parts of it I did like, and I actually enjoyed part of the theater experience because one of the theater experience, we actually got this for the first time. Um, <laughs> like when like whistling and cheering, a for little the Arjun hero came arriving. on the screen. We had people whistling and cheering. Yes, they had like when he did some cool stuff, stylish moments. That was so like I probably probably enjoyed some moments more than we would if we watched it at home. Absolutely. Because and of the sound is better yeah, in a theater. The overall experience with everybody, so that was really cool. And there were some parts I did enjoy, but overall, I think th where it fails, uh, you can tell me if you agree, is they marketed this wrong. Mar yeah, the trailer doesn't even come close to showing you. You thought this was going to be like RR, like action-packed. I'd say there's less than a fourth action in this entire thing. Yeah. It's mostly dialogue or a, I, I think, a pointless relationship. Agreed. Like right, I I agree, and I'm I hate that I had to say it because I was actually very excited to see this film. I, I was too, but I feel like I was thinking that while we were watching it, I was like, I enjoyed the trailer more because I mm -hmm. thought the trailer was what this was going to be, mm -hmm. and this isn't what the trailer conveys. They they marketed it as almost a KGF, right? And right, actually towards the beginning, I was actually enjoying. I was like, okay, cool, we're in for the yeah. The first, the first twenty minutes, I was a, like, okay, here we go, a big action star. Yep, and. I actually got this for the first time because a lot of people talk about this with their the, their favorite stars. They're very stylish, right? Yes. Alu Arjun in this, you, he's nothing but stylish. It's all style, right? Um, and so I was actually enjoying that, and kind of like in KGF, he's he's very stylish in that, and he does a lot of these these over the top things. There's no physics, nothing. Yeah, nothing believable. But in in KGF. Like it's yeah, action packed, and there's a story, yeah. and it keeps you engaged. Correct. This thing, man, it dragged. Yeah. And I, I just one. Why would you market it that way? And you could have cut an hour, if not more, out it's, of this it's, film. It's three, and feels like five. Yeah. Yeah. It's 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 so disappointing because yeah. I really wanted to enjoy this. So film. did I. I was doing everything I could <laughs> to try to enjoy it, and then at about the two hour and oh, fifteen man. mark, I was just I had given up. And okay, so. That's that's the piece. It's it's as did the guy next to me. He took three phone calls oh, during the movie. Did. <laughs> he did. <laughs> no joke. He, did. he was done. A hundred percent. And got up like three or four times. Yeah. yeah. And so that's that's probably the biggest issue with this film. One, it's it, it's way an hour to an hour way and a half long. too long. Way too long. Like they could have, I think, because there were some good parts. Like there was some good action parts that I was like, okay, good. Let's stick with this. Keep driving with this. And they don't. They just go to some different thing, either with the pointless love interest, yeah, or to a, a bunch of dialogue that I'm like, okay, I thought we already rehashed this part like twice already. Yeah. And they just keep going back to it. And like, 
I just, I think you could have cut an hour out and you could have literally made it like all fun, jungle, defying physics yes. fight scenes. Save, got, here's how you could have saved time and money. Cut all of the sequences where you used bad CGI for logs in water. <laughs> that that happened way too much. Honestly, you could have cut the entire love relationship. Yeah, that we even, didn't need that. Even though I thought the actress was good, and but it was like almost pointless the entire thing. And also the relationship was a little problematic. The, the yeah, whole, it was a it little was bit. Like, yeah, <laughs> it was. It was. I'm not gonna give anything away because this is the non spoilers. But it was like a little strange the way they built this relationship it was uh it, it, it gave me the feeling and it, 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 it none of them are this long but like this will probably be appealing for people who are just fans of Edward this and, style yeah, and of him in the same way that like you could never talk people out of loving uh, uh jean-claude van damme or jason statham mm -hmm. they're gonna the fans are dedicated they love it and if you don't like it you're a moron yeah that's what's gonna happen with this movie yeah i i definitely say so but i even think some of the fans that were in there they were really excited i feel like a lot of them got bored well i got there was a lot of getting yeah. up yeah it was a lot of getting a lot up, of getting there was, up. There was, and it was quiet it was quiet for most of the film outside of a few moments and I thought we were going to get a lot more action scenes in this yep. because that's what it, it, it promoted. It, yeah. pro it almost promoted like it was either KGF or RRR coming. Yeah, I'd say of the three hours, there was probably 25 minutes, yeah. if that, of action. Of action? Yeah. And people don't go into John Wick expecting to see a lot of dialogue and, and acting from mm. Keanu Reeves. They no. go in to see headshots and some cool stunts. Yeah. That's why you go into these films. And so I feel like they didn't know what kind of film they were making. And I know India has these masala films, but I feel like you, there's got to be a structure to it. Right. At least at some point. Yeah. I mean, okay. So the things I did enjoy, I thought Louis Arjun and what he did, I thought was like, he did what they wanted him to do. Yeah. I thought it could have been a lot better if they would have shortened it and made him just a stylistic star that was kicking ass the entire time. Right. But they didn't stick to that. No. I mean, and it was really incongruent too, to mm -hmm. see him be the stylist. Uh, kick-ass dude who's quite boyish with it, it, well I didn't find it to be charming I found yeah. it to be incongruent yeah. when he's around the girl yeah yeah. Uh, and I thought even though once again I thought the, the story was pointless I thought the girl did well um, and, and all that and I the songs they were good they were in they were like uh, but it was like by the t here's here's the, here was the issue with a lot of the good parts by the time they came I was like okay exactly <laughs> exactly <laughs> So I was like, that's a, the song with Samantha, really sexy song. Sexy song, great. great number, and a couple of cool moves in it. But by that point, you're like, yeah, one of the credits. Yeah, and like he, he had a couple good uh, songs with the, the girl. And then at the end, there was this cool song that I think if we watched it alone, we were like, that's yes, a really cool song. we would have loved that last thing as a standalone Yeah, video. I think they're, they're good, good songs. Yeah. Um, but it's like by the time you get to them, you're like, oh, my God. I mean, at least I enjoyed this five minutes of the song. Um, yeah. Because, <laughs> like, it, it just drags, man. And then by the time we got to Fafa, it's like... I, it was like... <laughs> <laughs> I was actually hoping when they do the reveal on him, it was just going to be the end. Yeah. And then it just continued. And even with Fafa, I was like, yeah. oh, great. Yeah, and I... Like, they built it up to this second part, and I'm like, why? You literally could have just had the good villain the entire time. Did you? I got to ask a question. God. This is a slight spoiler. It's not because you guys know that this is part one. Yeah. But there's a, there's a moment when it said second interval. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I got so scared. <laughs> I thought it was the end for more. I thought I, I, it's at the end. Yeah. Because they want you to know that this is part mm -hmm. one. They're reminding you again. But when it said second interval, I thought... Another intermission? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, totally agree. So, but, uh, I thought it's Fafa, right? Uh, but they, they, one, they had this weird overdubbing thing, yeah. it, which you know I, I kind of accepted towards the beginning, but um, that it always takes away from the performances for me. But I wasn't going into this film expecting like no. crazy performances. No. Fafa did well, obviously. Fafa doesn't do bad, but it's like by the time once again, by the time he came on, I was like, well, I wish you were here in like the first. Yeah. Two hours. <laughs> no, it's true. Like, I'm, I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. Mm -hmm. Daniel Day Lewis could have walked onto the screen, and I would have went, "Oh, cool. Hope he's not on long." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and so, man, it's 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 disappointing. Yeah, it's because like I I wanted to really enjoy this film. Yep, uh, I was excited for it. I and also like the the even though the cinematography was nice, it didn't come across as nice as it did in the trailer. Correct. 
Like, because I was expecting to be blown away by the visuals the way I'm in in Sanjay Lila Bansali kind of films, right? But it, even though it was nice, it didn't blow me away. No, like, I remember commenting on how beautiful the lighting was for day shots on the trailer. Mm -hmm. Didn't convey in the big screen. Yeah, and it was like, it was nice, but it's not, it wasn't like a, I was expecting to be encapsulated by the visuals. Me too. Of it all, and it, that wasn't there. And yeah. it was, it's weird, man. Yeah. And I'm sorry, sorry. If, if you guys are mad at us for this, and like, you know, we hate Toluga, even though that's not, not true at all. But yeah. um, it's just... No, but I will say, if that's a particular thing that's the vein in the same way that I mentioned, like, you have the kinds of films that are a Jason Statham film or a... Because or a, those aren't just action films or a Jean-Claude Van Damme. Yeah. They're a very particular kind of action film that strains credulity and... Which is fine. It's fine if that's what you like. Uh, I, I just, I wasn't expecting this to be that kind of movie, uh, so it adds the disappointment. Yeah, I would have been totally fine if this was all, like, the big, like, you know, pushing people 25 feet by, you know, that. I would have actually been totally fine. I was like, okay, I'm in for this, right? Right. We're in for the ride. But, man, there was barely any of it. It was like, <laughs> they had, like, an hour of, like, just boredom in between each thing. Yeah. And it was just, it's not what it advertised. And that was just, it was disappointing. Yep. Uh, it's like if we went into RR and they barely had any action, I'd be disappointed. Yeah. Because you're, you, what you conveyed to me was that you're going to bring me fun action. Right. And that's what, that's what I wanted. And you, you just, that's not what I got. Yeah. <laughs> and so... Yeah, yeah. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Uh, if, you can't uh, win them all. But you know, let us know what you thought about the film, uh, and uh, if there's a. Uh, this is our this is our first Alu Arjun film, but he wasn't really the issue with this film. No, feel, in fact, I, I don't have any complaints about no. him. I think he did what he was supposed yeah, to do, and he was. I thought he was stylish. stylish. I thought he was like. He, I mean, we actually didn't get a great dance number from him, which I was hoping for. No, but the uh, dance but numbers they he were did, fun. they were fun. Um, and, you know, I liked him, but I f wish the filmmaking would have helped him in the film of, like, not being three hours long. Yeah. <laughs> that could have helped a lot. A lot. So. Yeah. That's the review, guys. There you guys. go, guys. Uh, well, it was our first time. We're actually going to be going to the theaters a lot here in the Thankfully, next couple yes. weeks. Uh, with, you know, uh, Jersey uh, 83, 83 RR, RR, RR coming out um, and all that. Uh, so we're going to be going back to the theater. So that's very, very exciting. I was glad exciting. to see it was mostly full. That was mostly it was full mostly for full. our little tiny theater. Yeah, we even though Spider Man theater. just came out. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, that was good to see. So let us know what you thought about the film and what should be the next Atulugu film that we watch down below.